And we're live. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Yep. We'll wait and see if we'll get some people in here. I'll we'll go from there. Yep. Uh oh. Hmm. That's interesting. Hope everybody had a good day today. Gotta go around the block to get this one. See, that's what happens when you leave that on, you get feedback. Okie dokie. Yeah. I don't know if anybody's going to come on or not, but we're going to talk about headsets. How to garden. What's up? We'll see if we get about, about 10 people in here. But yeah, we're going to talk about, talk about headsets tonight. And we got a surprise in the back here. So it'll be about three products we're going to check out tonight. And I invited Matt Arnold. Told him I'll be on live at 8 o'clock. He's got stuff too he wants to show, show. So it'll probably just be me and Matt up here and nobody else. Might just be me. So how's how the garden doing tonight? No oh, pizza on a prowl like always. So. Yeah, I figured instead of doing a video on a product, I'm going to do a live on a product. I see Drewy boys up. Get your headset, Drew. Go grab it. We're going to do a headset review tonight. I want your feedback on it. So go get your headset, boy. <laughs> Is he going to do it? I don't know. Please hit the like button when you can. Please make sure you got everybody on the list here, which is not many on there, but always double check and triple check and make sure that you got everybody because YouTube, like I keep saying, he's taking them out. So. Get rain coming. It's probably already raining out there. Put the truck away in the barn. I was out working in the barn. Matt Arnold had uh, had a live today. I was on there a couple times. <clears throat> uh, excuse me. Even showing tan, um, showing Whitey, the kitty cat. So you might want to go and find uh, Matt Matt Arnold's uh, web page there and check out his live that he did today he just got off about 15 20 minutes ago so see if drew finds can find his headset if he's still if he's still here didn't tell him i was gonna do this as good as he had do i was gonna do this the other day but yeah things keep coming up like they always do so yeah, try and get the barn cleaned out. And I got as much as I can get out. Try to get uh, Drew to come over and do a little bolt nut fishing. Hey, never came to help. I guess that uh, fishing for bolts and nuts and flat washers and lock washers is not appealing to them. <laughs> you get a magnet and you sit there. It's got a string on it. You just let it wing right down. Hey, Mix Mowers, what's up? Working on a railroad? Yeah, always working. That guy works 24-7. When do you sleep? Are you on there? Do you, do you sleep against the wall or something or what? Yeah. Well, come on up anyhow. Voice your opinion. We're going to do a product review on headsets tonight. And probably after that, we'll just open the panel up to... All good, good, good stuff. So I did put uh, 3M headset and more, so that covers everything. Yeah, but mine's going to be different. Come up and, we'll and you find out. Matt, he, I think he wouldn't get something to eat, so. One of him come up too to voice his opinion. 
So Tomo's going live at 8. So hope everybody had a good day today. Like I said, it's probably start, It's probably already raining. Hey, Drew, is it raining in Medina? Probably so, because I put the truck away, because I seen that green stuff heading our way. So, nobody comes up at 8.10, and I'll just tell you my opinions on this stuff. But we got three, three products I want to talk about. Oh, maybe a video been a lot better, huh? <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll tell you everything that I know about it and so forth and what I learned about these and the range and all that good stuff. You want the link? Is that what you're waiting on? Someone knocking. Hello? I thought you just fly up here. I mean, I thought you had ma magical powers. You just pop up here. Uh, I was just testing you out. See how smart you are. Links there. Anybody want to come up? That has a 3M headset. Want your opinion on it? If you got, you got this is a Bluetooth. So if you got the Bluetooth headset, come on up. Tell me your opinions about it. But we still get to transport people. Oh. Yeah, I have mixed feelings about mine. So? But it's not it's gonna bad. Be, it's going to be more. Well, you'll find out in a minute. Yeah, I was thinking about doing a video, but I just can't get to mine. It's in my trailer, and it's just too much stuff in there right now to get to them. You should all you should, in your did you take the batteries out? You know, honestly, I can't remember if I did or didn't. Maybe, maybe not. You know, if they go bad, so be it. I'll tell you right now, in the wintertime, do not leave these things in your trailer or in the shop where it's cold. The batteries will they will freeze. When it gets cold enough. So you do not want to do that. Hey, Michelle, what's up? So don't leave your headsets in your trailer or in your shop because batteries, you know, it's got acid in it. They will freeze and possibly explode. And your $40, $50, $80, $100 headset will be trash. Well, maybe tomorrow I'll go in there when it's light and maybe get tomorrow. Maybe too dark tomorrow. now. <laughs> Take them out. Get get your light out. You got a light on your cell phone. Mm -hmm. You got all kinds of excuses. Yeah, do it tomorrow in the light. Yeah. I told Matt I'm waiting on him, so we'll see what he if he says anything or not. Wow. Yeah, I was thinking about doing a video. Sure, you were. Probably next week on it. Sure you are. Mm -hmm. Just like a blah, blah 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 blah. Just like a review on the vest too. What vest? Traffic vest. No one really had reviews on them. Uh -huh. I did. But I don't have to wear traffic vest because mine has the stripes on them. Mm -hmm. Except these are the old ones. All right, what we have, we're going to talk about tonight is a 3M. What's up, Mick? How you doing? 3M blue Bluetooth headset. You turn your, uh, you hit this down here and you hold it. And that blue light comes on, I mean, it's on. It will tie into your phone. Mm -hmm. And you could, you can listen to your own music. You can listen to the AMF film that's built in this thing. 
I mean, I do both. I get tired of the radio, then I switch over to the Bluetooth and I listen to stuff in my phone. I put rechargeable batteries in here and does the same thing. That way you can recharge them instead of uh, wasting all that money on batteries. Absolutely. I have found out that the headband is pretty soft, but I also found out that these little knobs here, you can probably see them a little ripped. They will rip in time. Mm -hmm. Because of the use and that's a little dirty. Apologize for that. But these things will eventually come apart. I had one. This is my second pair of this so far. I have a third pair in the barn. Well, in the office, I should say. I tried to sell Drew, but he never had the money. Thanks for visiting my house. I appreciate that. Every time when you drop these things, these things here came off. off. Yep. They're not, they don't break. Your little foam and that will pop out too. I'm not going to do that. They're a pain to get back in. But if you drop it on the floor of the trailer, these will pop off. And, you know, you're like, oh my God, I just paid all that money and they're broke. But they will snap in. You got to play with them a little bit to do it. I showed you some love there, uh, Michelle. Yeah, I've got. Yeah, I've got um, one of those too, but mine's a little bit different. You know, it's mine just just don't have that little thing here. Yeah, mine's the same one as yours is. The only difference in mine is mine's got a. Uh, you can still use three batteries. Mm -hmm. This right here will come out of there, and you can use three batteries. And a little hard to get out of because it's locked down in there. And this is probably one of the newer ones that they have. So far, I ain't had no problem with mine. Mine has the same thing. That yours and how do you charge that little brick? Just plug it into the USB port right here. Oh, like and from your computer or whatever. Yeah. Plug, uh, plug it into the USB. So how long does that take to charge if it's fully dead? Mm, take about three or four hours. And that's how long it takes. And and my um, if you if, if say for instance if somebody's is just getting into uh, lawn care or something, they don't have a smartphone or nothing like that. Think about the cheap pair of these, which is is pretty decent. They're cheap. You get them about $10, 12 $14. So anywhere right in there, they're good. And sorry about yeah. the camera going in and out. I don't have no control over that. And um, if you get, if you don't want to use one that's, uh, um, I don't even know if they make these headsets here anymore, but these are decent. 3M. Mm -hmm. You know, usually these things here break on them, on these. I've had these a little while, which is, they do pretty good. Um, let's see. Unless you drop yeah. them on the floor. You're going to break them already, right? Yeah. <laughs> and if, if, you, if you're out and you don't have, if you don't have blue, those, those three headsets are decent. This is the big boy 3M. These are ideal for, um, when you you don't have Bluetooth, if you want to use something like a little thing, go in your ear and put over top of them, it works mm -hmm. fine. You can do I've it that way. Now, I've done that before too when I didn't have no, didn't um, have these here. These are my last ones. So far, they've been pretty good. I ain't had a problem with them. These, the only thing I wish they would have do on these on the updates is the volume. You have to turn the volume up whenever you answer the phone, mm -hmm. because the end the volume same volume controls the volume of the radio and the telephone calls. And then what they should have is have a double knob here. One controls the radio, and the other one controls, or just push one time and switch to the <laughs> phone, and you can adjust the volume for it independently. 
That'd be a nice feature. They could, they could they could do that with a firmware update very easily. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, these are the next headsets I got by 3M. I got these way before, and these are just Bluetooth only, USB, and that. Okay. You got to, you got an input jack for you can plug mm -hmm. in a uh, something. These are decent. They're these are very good on the uh, isolation of the of the Noahs. The only thing I don't like it when you're talking on the phone, it picks up all the the noise. You hear all the noise, but it don't hear the person on the other end. But they don't hear it as bad. That's the only problem with these. Now. Here's the ones are junk. The isolation between the the the, the in here are de uh, decent. It, it, it's uh, they say oh they sell on websites it's like twenty five nrr just say about fifteen you know are on these. It does cut down some of the noise. These are comfortable i wish that thing wouldn't do like it's doing but they're decent they're they're comfortable up here the radio is iffy the microphone is junk and and these right here are these things warning don't buy them they waste of money they had these on there for about 70 80 dollars at the time they're probably 30 by now don't waste your time buying them. They ain't worth the money. If you just starting out, you don't have a lot for your budget. You can pick a these little set. They got they're decent on the, on your NRR. If they're they're comfortable to you, you can tell these are pretty well comfortable. It's got a good um, top part. Here, they're good. They're de they're very decent. They're, they're pretty, those are cheapest ones you can find, and these ain't that bad. They're a little bulky on your ears, but they work out fine. And these here, these are knock out just about every noise around. These are really good, but you don't have Bluetooth or none of that that fancy stuff that people like to have today. And those three three M's, I got four or five three M's. This is these are decent. They probably got these fixed by now. Updating them, they're decent. They're comfortable. Um, they don't have the cushion that, that I like, but other than that, they work fine. These these here so far, I ain't had no problem with them. On mine, I've had mine since last year. They're they're comfortable. They got the padding, and a lot of you know, pad, they do wear out over time, but these are still like brand new, and they will pop out like uh, Jim said. And But uh, other other than that, they're decent. This is probably the newer version than, than his, but they're all good. Uh, they only have one bad headset in the whole bunch of them. Just, just watch out what you go out and buy and... and, and and it just go from there. What I got on is a forty dollar headset I got from Amazon. It's Bluetooth. Got the mic on it. You can talk to people on the phone with it. I have talked to Drew on these. It can even hear while the mower is running. It's kind of hard, I think, for him, but he can understand me. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Um, the, these headsets, the one I'm talking about. They're work tunes. That's that's all they all work tunes, and uh, that you just look just look up work work tunes headsets. Yeah. They're pretty pretty decent headsets. I don't have exact model numbers. They don't they're not written down on them, but you can look them up on uh, on Amazon. Work tune headsets. Just look for this. This is a decent headset here. They're decent. Other than the Bluetooth, they may have fixed it by now. Just look at the reviews, and these are these headsets are uh, decent. 
The newer ones have probably got a digital for read out here by now. But these, uh, I got these a year ago. I, I don't know exactly what the model numbers are on them. Um, if you're just getting into lawn care, like I said earlier, and don't have a phone with, uh, I know people like Bluetooth. You could just buy something. Let me see if I can find it. Um, yeah, when I need it, can't find it. If you go, if you're going to just, if you want to, if you don't have the money to go buy a fifty or sixty dollar headset, you can go buy go buy these little things at Dollar General or somewhere right there for twelve, fourteen dollars. Work just as good. That's what I use. Um, yeah, yeah. Um, then eventually, I will I uh, will do a review on them all again, and I tell you which ones I recommend. I can get to that here and just you you can you can buy a little Bluetooth thing like this, which those are pretty decent. You can use those on those headsets, but these right here don't have the uh, NRR rating as as these do. These these have a decent one. These are about 25, between 25 and 45 dollars for these don't have Bluetooth or none of that. If you're just getting into it, you could get one of these and get you one of those if you want. And this is a cheaper pair. You can get these for less than $15 at probably Home Depot or, or Amazon somewhere. And they're just a cheap set. They're not very expensive. I don't know what you call them. They're just... Just look for um, ear protection. I, I, these were given to me by my neighbor uh, when I didn't have none, so they worked just fine until I bought. I run, I run. I had those, which they're decent. They're these has a model number 3M, but I doubt you'll be able to find these anywhere. And uh, Plexer. 3M, Optimum 105. These are decent. They're fine. But um, from my experience and what I do, um, I, I go by comfort, how comfortable they are and and the from the noise from the mower. And the three, there's three of them here that I like. Is these here three M's and they just uh, I don't know if you can see the just three and if there's on the other side these you can get them they use at Home Depot uh, that's where I got these between that one this one they're comfortable the noise uh, it knocks down the noise they do pretty well these are a slim line type 3m headsets and they are bluetooth the only thing i don't like about them is the audio when you answer the phone other than that they're fine um, the, the and these uh do really well the nrr is described as what it says how much for those these are around about fifty dollars you can get yeah. these on amazon I also think I found some of those, but they were way more expensive, like eighty to hundred, and I was like, "Wow, that's pricey." And the thing is, there's some, there's some of them get, they, they look nice. The uh, look, always look at the reviews. If you, I, I look at the ones that uh, on the reviews, like these things. There, it's decent. This is decent. They're comfortable. <laughs> They, they, this this is decent. I like that grasshopper. The uh, the audio the audio quality is is okay, but it, it's they're comfortable. Mm -hmm. They're comfortable, but the uh, the mic audio is is junk. Uh, it, it's the radio's iffy on it. A 3M's a lot better. If I'm gonna, if I had to go through and buy it all over again, 
out of three headsets. You buy the 3M. I will buy the 3M. There you go. Three headsets right here. I nah, just won. Well, backups. Yeah, see, yeah. I, would, uh, I would still buy these. If they're, yeah. probably, they're newer now. I would buy the, these mm -hmm. and these if you don't have Bluetooth. Yeah. Other than that, I would buy them. And if it, if it really gets serious in, in, the, in the stuff, in the communication wise. <laughs> He's still digging. <laughs> yeah, still digging is right. Which I, I wasn't expecting doing a review on headsets, so I wasn't prepared. Well, if I could take these and use them on my mower, these are the best headsets I got at all of them. Mm -hmm. The isolation in them is, is really good. And the microphone is good. You got you got your cable coming in that hooks to the radio. See, I use this to hook to it. And this just this about a sixty dollar headset. They're aircraft headsets are what they are. Well, those should be pretty good then. Now they this these here it come it 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 it's like that. It knocks out noise. You say something, I probably can't hardly hear you. What? I can barely can hear you with these on. What? I heard you say what then. <laughs> I can barely hear you with those yeah. headsets. And Andrew, most of these headsets that we have are one switch. That's the way new technology is. I mean, yep. Matt's got the same Bluetooth as I got. Well, like I was saying, now it's my turn, man. Now, All right. Like I said, this here is this this name right here, if you can see it. Got wow. them on. I got them on Amazon for like 40 bucks. Uh, as you can see on the sides, where the three ends have the smaller ends. These are a little bit more thicker. See how thicker these are, Matt? Yeah. These are a lot thicker right up here. Yeah. So these won't break off like I, like 3M's does. And this has a decent boom mic. Like I said, Drew could hear me even when I'm mowing lawns. That's good. Now, Drew, how much could you really hear me? I could hear you pretty good. I mean, you still heard the mower with a little bit of a hum, but... I mean, if you're doing loud stuff, I mean. Yeah. Uh, and the controls are on just center, on and off, plus and negative. That, that's all the controls they are. How's it going, and, Paul? Andrew likes to have more than one button, I guess, to play with. But unfortunately, these are only have one. Every ones that I have always had one button. And the battery pack in this one here holds three. AAA batteries again with the with the rechargeable batteries. The Duracell batteries I would not recommend. They might last you a week maybe, but I go through twelve ba twelve batteries before I find three good ones. So, mm. so what's that tell you? And, and a bad thing about some of those is they will corrode on you. I haven't had that problem yet. Some of them, I have seen some of the Duracell corrode on you quicker. And the band, and the band on there is solid. It's a little rough. Let's see if we can show you the bottom here. They got that there. It's not too bad, but this here is a little small for my fat head. I can wear them for about two hours, and it starts hurting my ears. Yeah. But the three ends, I can wear them all day long, so they're a little bit more wider than what this set is. Mm -hmm. But for forty dollars. You can talk people on the phone. I think it's worth it. I just wonder how, how those better ones are, like the eighty dollar ones or hundred dollar ones are. Let me let me this uh, let's see which one is it that I paid I paid for these things, these things around about seventy dollars. It was a joke. Yeah. Be very careful and then they got high price. Look at the reviews first before you buy anything. Look at the, how many uh, negative comments. 
you know, on these on these type mm-hmm. of headsets before you buy any headset, and then and then and in how many a lot of those reviews that, that you see they're, they're excellent reviews on the headsets make you wonder if any of those are employees that works for that company. Right. Look at the true. Look at the um the next one below it and down and the negative reviews and how many good reviews if you if you get if say the item like if you got say thousand reviews on that item look at how many good ones mm-hmm. and then look at how many bad reviews it's, it's on them and, and look at the price of them if it mm-hmm. if there are if any any decent good headsets were be, be between uh, fifty to a hundred dollars, but you do have some out there that are junk mm-hmm. that's selling for that price. Right. Be very careful. Check your reviews before you decide. Ask questions um, on 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 those headsets before you purchase a because you hate to get like I did with these things. These things, I don't recommend it to anybody, and that's the reason why I save them for a review later. Right. And yeah. they're cheaply made, uh, cheap. It, it, it's got you can buy a chart, you can buy a thing put in there, but the thing is, don't buy any. It's from overseas because if you do, you're going you're gonna to be stuck with it. There is, there are, you can't get parts for it. You can't, 3M, you can go through their support and mm-hmm. they will do everything they can to help you and, and replace it. And their warranty is, is pretty, pretty good. I think uh, next pair I get, whenever that is, which I have two of them that are still in okay shape, but uh, I think I'll get the 3M, uh, the actual Bluetooth ones and all that. Exactly. And, See, I like like me for instance. The, this little headset I've had for the computer, which I don't. I used it back when I done um, ATC on flight simulator, and um, it's just a basic little headset. Ain't it's cheap? And you can. Mm-hmm. I bought I bought that thing. I bought it three years ago and still have it. I ain't broke it yet. Right. I take I try to take care of my stuff. It's best to it, look at the cushion it has, mm-hmm. but it does not it, it does not have the isolation. It's not for cutting grass. It's it's for just mostly gaming. Right. Uh, I took your mouth. You got a headset what, like these, Jose? A headset, yeah. I have a good headset. Do you have it available? You can talk about it. Hey, Flo. Yeah. Hey, Flo. Hey, Flo. Hey, you got Flo. a headset? You want to come up and tell your opinion about your headsets? Okay. On uh, three M's here. On the sides here. Matt, does that is that the same thickness as what yours is, or about the or or are these more thicker? Because I haven't broke these at all. Man, yeah, mine's similar to that. Similar, so these might be just a, a little bit more thicker. Yeah, but these, but these here, you switch over to my camera, and you can you can see what um, mm-hmm. that's, that's his. Yeah, I'll that's see one. Is. Now, see one thing that I learned on the three M's, the one I was showing you there. Yeah, that that Drew called me one day, and I'm going. I don't have the other headset because the other headset's got the boom mic on it. Right. So mm-hmm. this one's got the boom mic. Like I said, he he can hear me. I I'm mowing lawns. I mean, he can hear me great. But the three, is that the three don't, is that don't the three have, It doesn't have the mic at all. But there's a little mic inside here somewhere that picked up. I was about thirty feet away from my truck. And I stopped the mower, and I talked to Drew for about 20 minutes. Crystal yep. clear. And the book says up to 30 meters. 
So I guess that's pretty close to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if anybody wants to know about the three M's, here's a brand new. They'll give you the model number and that, give you the idea of what this is. That's the same, that's the same thing as mine. Yeah, Different yeah. Color. But this is brand new in a box. This is the one I got. I got two of them from Amazon. It's been about 50 to 60 bucks a piece on these. Are you going to give them away or are going to sell them? I'm keeping it. These are that's good. What, that's the same thing as mine. Yeah, this tells you all about the controls and that. Tell me one thing. I ain't selling you anything. These are good. Yeah, yeah. too good for Jose. I want a pair hey, like you're lucky. If you're lucky, go around the yard sales and flea markets. You might find a good pair. Um, yeah, yeah. Because the one, the ones I have are just simple ones where you don't hear shit. You know. Yeah. They're just the basic ones, the old regular lawnmower ones. Yeah, he went. He went to uh, Jose there for a minute, Andrew. Well, he was showing his hit, uh, his uh, his headset there. So where did you go? I don't know. I think he fell off the, in the hole again. <laughs> He's wandering off in some other uh, southern dimension or something. I reckon. Hey, Les, how you doing? Anybody uh, on the chat has any questions about these two or Matt's five different type of headsets? I mean, I do like like this. I didn't think I would, but if people can hear me and I can keep on mowing, that's great. I mean, like I said, you go to Amazon, look up the uh, uh, Rifleman. They only have one 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 set here. Uh, like I said, I spent about forty bucks on these, and these about fifty six to sixty dollars for the three M ones. No, they they do they do have a headset out there, but it's a little pricey, around about three hundred dollar mark. That oh, yeah, allow you to, uh, that allow you to use uh, connect to your radio, the Bluetooth, oh, yeah. and also you can connect with five more headsets. Those things are pricey. Well, I seen the blue one that you showed. It's about ninety five dollars through Amazon. If that's the same one, yeah, I'm not too sure. They also have a red one's like a hundred and ten or whatever. Yeah, I was thinking, I was thinking about upgrading and getting that, but I thought, huh, I got this one. This thing works good. Might as well just just keep on using it. <laughs> Stop snoring with them. <laughs> Damn. That's pretty bad. Which one's my favorite? I would say 3M because they're a lot looser on my fat head. This set right here, the Rifleman, within two hours, they seem like they shrink. They get a little more push in your ears, and so my ears start hurting everything. But I would recommend 3M out of any out of these, especially the Bluetooth, because you can run your own music through your phone. You could have your AM, FM radio. You can also program the stations that you like. Bad thing is when you turn it off and turn it back on, you got to reprogram again. And if you lose but, the battery, yeah. Yeah, but if you if you use them on a certain station, that station will stay there. It won't, it won't go away. Now, if, if, you get, if you got a charger uh, recharge battery before yeah. it goes dead, you just take it. You just take it and charge it, and just it'll keep the memory of it. But if, if, if he goes dead, it's gone. It's wiped. I'll well, see. I don't see. Well, I got just this one, one little okay, little port down the bottom here. Now you got a, you, you got a USB port and a and another one down there. You can charge. You can actually charge it through that. Yeah, right down there. I don't use that. I I didn't think I could do that. No, you can. But it, it looks like you can hook up some other. Some other stuff right there too, the the round one, and of course that one there that Matt's saying about charging. I guess what I do is I have a bunch of batteries, rechargeable batteries that I charge up all the time through the summertime, and I take a dozen of triple A's, double A's with me every day. So I just swap them out. That's all I do. Yeah, those those are yeah. That's that's kind of like the one we have right there, Andrew. That's not a bad price for them. Yeah. But I was thinking about getting a bigger one like this here, but after you show me that blue one, I'm like, hmm, I don't know. 
I wouldn't uh, waste my t- I wouldn't waste my time on on them. Right. I would not. I would not. That's one headset. If I could sit there and beam it back to them, I would. This is mm-hmm. this is a joke. It's decent on the headset part. On this part, this this uh this part's comfortable. That they're comfortable. This is good here, but as for the microphone, it sucks. <laughs> yeah, I throw them in the garbage. I ain't throwing them in the garbage. That they, they can still be used. But, uh, the the the. the the NRR rating is still decent. They're comfortable. I use them, but I'm not going to use them as for what they're intended. To. The other, right? Uh, it's just I will still use them, but I just as for yep. the radio and the Bluetooth, that's not worth it. Did you go get your headset, Drew, or something like that, or, or what'd you do? No, I had to hit the bathroom, get some laundry up. Oh man, mm-hmm. he fell in. Ah! All right, you see right here, F600. This is a dual camera that I use in my truck. My truck, not trucks, truck. Maybe you guys might want to get these. You can get them off eBay, which I found is a lot cheaper than Amazon. I mean, you're going to spend close to 60 to 100 bucks on this, but it's worth every every penny. Right. These have your windshield things you can plug in. Your cameras, you can... You got it right and left. You can have one in the front of your vehicle, the other one on your on your uh, window. So if anybody ever comes up and do anything, surprise, you got them on recorder. Yeah. These are pretty decent. I, I've, I've been using this, not this particular model, well, for a year now, but this company is pretty darn good. They're, they're pricey, but they're worth it. Every bit of it, and it tells what you what is like forty bucks. Uh, you go go to Amazon and punch up the F six hundred, and it'll tell you. I mean, they're more pricey on Amazon than they are on on eBay. Mm-hmm. What is that? A stereo? No, this is a dash cam. Oh, okay. You might you might see some of his reckless driving in it. Yeah. Show you what it does in that. Pretty decent. I like yeah. it. And I will take it out of the box and show you everything. You can get it you can get it around eighty bucks on Amazon. That's just what it kept you there. Everything comes with little plastic bags. This is what it looks like. It's just a little small miniature F600. You can move your cameras all the way around, all the way around to the back. It's 120 degrees on both sides. Mm-hmm. So and really, you could have one side. point out towards the road and one towards the back. Well, when you got it like this here in front of you, you turn this camera to the front of the vehicle and this other camera towards your driver door. Or if you put in your rear in your rear windshield, it will it will look like that. Mm-hmm. And that way you're recording front and back. I do that all the time. Gives you your your power cords. I got a couple power cords because I took the other kits and put them as one. Andrew, Andrew asking what brand is that? F600, Andrew. Got your suction. It's a very small suction cup unit. Very tiny, very small. But I tell you what, with all the summer heat, it stays on the windshield. You you just take and spit on it like I do and just, you know, and rub it on there at night. Andrew will love that, you know, kind of rope it in, rope it in. Yeah. Honestly, though, I feel like it'd be worth it. I mean, even if it was, you know, 80 bucks after shipping, I mean, that might save you in a bad accident if someone creams you and it's not your fault. You take exactly. a stick on the windshield, and it, as you see right there, it sucks it right on. 
it's on there for a while. And you can also I'll take a move this here. You can also take the camera on and off of the in the back because it does go on and off nice and easy. Little cord there. So when you got your when you got your machine hanging up like this, all you do is push up, take it out, change your disc, and put it back. You're good to go. This goes on uh, goes on the bottom of the unit, which is pretty easy to do. I don't have one with me. I should have grabbed one. Uh, 32 gigabytes is the highest you can go. You can put extra audio on there if you want. And your power goes on the other side. Pretty easy. E even Drew could do it if he would just spend the money and buy one. Mm -hmm. All the stuff that he tells me about what he does, what happens out there, I think he should have one or two. I'm I got thinking one about it. One in the front, one in the back, and this is my backup unit. And one nice thing about people on eBay is that if you have any problems with this, you write to them. I've had one that it won't power up at all. So I got extra suction cups and power cords, as you see here. They sent me a new one because they don't want the old one back. Amazon will do the same thing, of course. So, uh, Blind TV. Uh, yeah, in, in, uh, Christie's in the house. Like, like I said, they're pricey, but they're real, real, uh, really worth it. And if you buy the SD cards, make sure they are scan disk, which I would Absolutely. recommend that a lot. I had bought some that wasn't scan disk, and they one time use they kind of got screwed up. I don't know why, but they do. Yeah, flake out on you quick. Yeah, real real fast. But mm -hmm. there's a guy on eBay that sells five of them for like fifty bucks. I bought a set, never had any issues. Yeah, scan disk is the best to have. Scan disc, yeah. And those plug into a cigarette lighter, don't they? Yep, yep. Yeah, blind TVs in the house. Your lighter adapter. Yep. Right there. Gives you like 30, 30 feet, I think, on the cord. Yeah, and that'd be a write-off, too, because that's for your business, because it's uh, safety. This here's an audio video jack you can plug in. You might be able to plug this into your... Um, your truck there and you might be able to get to watch it down below instead of watching on that screen the screens sc what size is this screen <laughs> 2.7 l lcd and 32 gigabyte is the uh, 32 gigabyte tf cards uh, is the only one that that, that you can use and that, that cable I showed you was a av out audio video out I'm, I'm gonna get and it's uh, 30 frames per second, which is pretty darn good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because uh, my stereo on my car, I have a double den. It's a Pioneer, and uh, yeah. I have the camera for the front and the back. So every time I put it in reverse, I can see the rear. Or when I'm driving, I can just click on my stereo for the front camera, and I can see everything. Right. right. Well, you, this, you don't have to do that. You just plug it in a cigarette lighter. Uh, Drew's truck and mine. We have center consoles. If you plug it in there, you, yeah. you never have to unplug it. It operates by key of the cool. truck. So you turn the truck on, they come in automatically. When you shut the truck off, they'll shut off automatically. But that's all he has to do. Now, if he wants to keep them on, plug them in the regular cigarette lighter, go into like Walmart or something. If he has something in the back of the truck, like, like salt, salt spreader, or whatever, Camera's on all the time, as long as it's got, it's got power. I mean, you can put your date and time and all that good stuff in the camera. It comes with instructions, which I don't have here, but I don't need it because I know what I'm doing. I have had to plug that three uh, thing in my uh, console there with three things and plug the two cameras in there and something else well, and then just hide it all in there. It's got its own screen, so you really don't have to do that, but... That's what it's for. If we had the instructions, I'll tell you more about it. But it's pretty easy. I mean, there, there's a lot of people that does product reviews on here. I thought, hey, let's have a live product review. It's different, right? 
That's right. Uh oh, we're all in trouble. Oh crap! If it's that mo if it's that blind mug coming up here, I'm getting off. <laughs> Steven's live. No. Boy, that's funky. Yeah, that's right. Oh, there is. Wow. Comes and goes. My bad. It's beef for tea, up, please. What's up? He's trying out his new camera. What's up, Buford? What's going on? Got to figure out In what years? the dead game volume is. <laughs> You're freezing on this trash. Well, that's all I have for you guys tonight. I just figured that a live product review would be a lot better than just making a video. I thought. Plus, yeah. Plus, we tell you more, more in depth how we've been using this stuff to tell you our inputs on this stuff. So, was it a good? Yep. Yeah, I want to do a product review on these shoes as well, guys. These Converse. I see them. I, I recommend y'all guys buying them. Oh, that's about ten minutes. <laughs> right. Hey, blind. No, I'm sorry, people that came in. I didn't say hi to you or anything. So let's concentrate on this stuff here. What's up, grasshopper? What's up, Chris? A grasshopper had good sayings about Andrew and the two buttons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good going, Grasshopper. I like that. Yeah, cameras can be put as equipment. Yeah, yeah on, go like each frozen. On the camera, you, you get this here, too. This is part that you need. To Wave your hand, Buford. You plug in your computer in that. Yeah, he's froze big time. Mm -hmm. Who's that? Buford is. Hey, he's playing with that new camera he got today. Almost looks like the camera that I have that I haven't played with mine yet. What don't you play with, uh, Jim? Take care, Grasshopper. He plays yeah, with everything. Thanks for coming in. Uh, that, was a, that was a great comment. I like that. Anybody else have any have any questions on the product we have uh, showed you? Let me know. I'll probably have a few more of these. I like to do the uh, a Don Juan grip that's on my trimmers and edgers out in the shop. I probably take my cell phone. I get more power like the lawnmower man does. And I could show you how to put it on and take it off. Uh, that'll be a long video. Yeah. yeah. Buford, you're real choppy, bud. He's moving. Yeah, he's moving like. Also, I got uh, gas cans that I got. I can do a, a review on. So I bought a sure can two point two two point two for mix. From mix. No. You said you bought a sure can two point two gallons, right? Yeah. For which you gonna use it for gas or for mix? Mix it for mix. Two cycle. Mm -hmm. Now I bought a bracket and everything to put it <laughs> mounted in the trailer. And it's there all the time. And I tell you what, where I got it mounted, it really works out beautifully. You don't have to worry about it. The 2.2 the .2 gallon tank will last me a long time. It's surprising how much two cycle you do use. Yeah, we got all kinds of stuff we could do product re pro product re re reviews on, but I just figured I would do a live instead of doing a uh, camera type, as I can tell you my opinion up and down. And that just like Matt was telling you about that blue headset, it's a piece of poopy. Yeah. Yep. So if anybody else wants to come up, put the link down. We'll open it up for any kind of discussions you guys have. Got room for a few more. Come on up and talk to us. 
<laughs> Everybody's so learn anything, Drew? Live show. Oh yeah. I would really recommend you get since you got that trailer in that. Problem is with a rear type camera, and the well, you got a rear type in the, your bumper and that, but they have something that records all the time. I mean, you can record all day long if you want to. Right. I mean, it's only a five amp service, but your disc ink is only good for four hours. So in eight hours, you're going to record the first four hours that's gone. That's why. I, that's why I'm kind of I'm constantly swapping mine out all the time. Chris, if even you if I just the, got one in the camera. chat, give me a thumbs up, bro. Give me a thumbs up in the chat, Chris. Just throw in here. Yeah. Even Everybody if I just got one up. camera and used it for driving and stuff, and at the end of the day, I could take it out, delete it if nothing would happen, and then I'd be good to go. Well, Still, see, least. see, like me, I go to Hinkley and I back in the driveways and that. I don't see it because I'm trying to back in the driveway, but reviewing the disc later on, you see the morons trying to go around you. I mean, it's just a glimpse. Yep. Uh, and you sometimes you might get their license number, maybe not. It all depends. I mean, it, it is a clear picture. Yeah. But all the sun is yeah, in your face and that it's going to be, you know, blurry or whatever. That's what they want you to do to back into them. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm taking. Well, I'm going to do a product review on my I, my 18 IR cameras I have in my truck. Oh, uh, I have one camera mounted on one side. I'm going to put a secondary on the other side where I can see around the trailer. Because I almost hit a couple of people during the <laughs> summer because I couldn't see them behind the trailer. And, and you were And you have that same issue, but he would have to put the camera at the butt in of the trailer and run the wires through under his truck and everything in to plug it in. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't have to do that. If, if me have a service body truck, I can, it's, you know, it's wide. So I can put a camera here and a camera there and I can watch. I, you can only see so much, but that's where these other cameras, that's where these cameras still, still plays a role because they're in your windshield front and back mm -hmm. and still recording. So if you think about it, I have eight cameras. Uh, yeah, eight cameras in my truck. Mm -hmm. Total. Yep. I'd like to put a light bar in the back of my trailer. I think that'd be nice. A light and, bar? And, yep. And, and like I said, if you go shopping and stuff like that, I keep my cameras on all the time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just whenever you, you go shopping, you have a I don't see nobody. He's down there. He's down He's there now. Kind of choppy. Yeah. What in the world is that right there? That's a hosier. He's using his mask. This is good. This mask is good for dust. Yeah. I got stuff I could show that too. I don't have any of that stuff. Oh, I do. I got eight of them I bought. I don't have any. But they're not Velcro. They slide on. You got to see the clown one I have. But it's tight on my fat face. <laughs> <laughs> but I tell, you what, I tell you what, girls drive down the street, they do a double take like, what the heck is that? <laughs> what is that thing? I even have a Western one. Now, if you go to my Instagram, Jim's Landscape 01, I got them on there. I also have them on, I made um, a couple of videos on them on, on YouTube here. So they're in my video. If you just, just watch my videos, all, all different type of mask. I don't think I did one for the lime green or orange one yet, but I haven't wore those yet. Mm hmm. Yeah, I need to get me a few of those myself. I don't have any. Yeah. Well, those masks are cheap. They do work. But like anything else, you wear glasses and that, the air yeah. will come up and fog your glasses up. Yeah. Yeah, so that's kind of unavoidable. For what he, what what Jose has for a mask, if he's got the holes in it, I don't know how he's going to stop the dust. 
I think I those masks glasses. you have might be a little bit better, even even at yeah. that RZ mask I have. Well, the RZ masks are fine, but the problem is I found out that the filters plug up real fast. And they're kind of hard to breathe at when you first get yes. them on because you're not used gotta, to them. Got to keep playing with, with the nose. Yeah. With the mask I got from Instagram through that company that Spencer's said that they're good, and they are good. Yeah, uh, what is it, I think? You buy one and get three free or something like that? I got eight of them. Three, yeah. three. I bought one and got seven free from the SA company. Mm -hmm. Well, can, you, can you hear me? I can hear you. You heard me, Jim? Send me one, man. They're only 20 bucks. Go to Instagram. They always pop them up on on advertisements. You, I think hey, man, I'm poor. I'm so poor, I'm man. You ain't going to donate. Mm, we I think I paid 10 bucks for shipping, so for 30, for 30 bucks, you get eight masks mm -hmm. any time that you want. Hell, uh, heck, they got... 30 to 50 some different type masks. They got all kinds of goofy ones, blood hanging off of them and everything. That, that'd be up your alley. <laughs> <laughs> like the good one. Yeah. They got all kinds of crazy ones. You wear that and say, I'll come bust your door down. <laughs> I even think they have your flag color, the flag you have behind me. I think they have one of that too. This one? Yeah. The Zoom in on that sucker. That's a nice flag. Zoom in on that sucker. You look at the that red, flag. The red one. That girl beside it. And mm. that girl in the back row. And you like that. This is why we're already ready because you never know what's gonna come up. <laughs> you gotta protect yourself. Right. Right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> hey Jerry, I didn't see you come in. I'm sorry. Whose mic is that? Somebody got something running in the background? Doesn't bother me any. So hopefully everything was informant enough. But I mean, Matt showed a lot of headsets, so if you're starting out, if you can't afford the, the Bluetooth types, I mean, you can still get the lower ones or just get the plain ones, but always get 3Ms. Now you really got me thinking about the one I was going to get from Amazon there, Matt. <laughs> that thing's a piece of poop. Mm. <laughs> After what I've been through with them, with them I, yeah. I just have to. You have to be very careful what you buy these days. I see you waving there. I see you waving, stiff. Man, he just mm -hmm. like that, lagging pretty bad. Yeah. Drew, yeah, is that all big. you can say, bro? Mm hmm. Ah, uh, maybe. No. What you guys got to learn about Drew? He's always got his head down. Mm -hmm. He's always playing with his damn phone. Yeah. I say we have the basement. phone. He can't get off the phone for anything. I mean, anything. We put him in the basement, Jim, for a couple minutes. See if he's strained on This is a 3M product review, not, not bash on Drew. That's right. Yeah, we can do that later. Yeah, because maybe Drew might go on later, and uh, we'll go over over to his place. <laughs> I was thinking about doing a live to tonight. That. Oh, I'm just going to do a short one tonight. If you want to get yours up and running, everybody go see Drewy Boy if he's going to actually do it this time. Last time he said he's going to do it. Oh, I got internet problems and stuff like that. What's operator error? Exactly. As you see, internet's working fine right now at the moment. So. He could blow and smoke in a camera. It might work a lot better. <laughs> it's not that. It's the internet. So, 
<laughs> really? The old technology. We, I think, I really strictly believe that it well, is the that, router. The haze over your head that's shining mm -hmm. off in your mug. spot there. That mug is so ugly. Look at it. <laughs> oh, well. Look at that mug. What's this? Oh. Uh, like life things. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> he likes big things just like Andrew. Yeah, right. Hello. <laughs> Hello. 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 It's it's Jose. Is Josie there? I got a problem with it, that mug. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't mow my yard today. Hey, Jackie, what's up? What's up, Jackie? I smell smell weed. <laughs> Said that, <laughs> Jackie. Probably because yeah, of the uh, truth. Four twenty, dog. That's all it cost my house now. The damn telemarketers. Gotta love it. Can't fix it really up in a minute. Gotta love those telemarketer boys. <clears throat> Yeah, um, today I had, there have been eight today called. Yeah. And I did do a product review of my trailer. Drew did a shorter one, but I did a longer in depth one about the bold tires and stuff. It's in the video archive. So if you, you have a sure truck trailer, 18 by seven, check it out. Got over 300 videos up. Mm -hmm. I'm on. I'm on. I'll probably end up doing a full review on that on the on both of my mowers. Yeah, well, I did. Stuff. I did yeah. a couple. Uh, one on my tank and one on the Pro Z. So I did so far. Yes. Have you gained any subscribers lately, Jim? Why? Just asking. I don't know. I haven't checked yet. Man, I've lost five. Not mentioning because you always have a cow about it. Hmm? Jose down there, I told him I, I didn't check and tell him because he probably, because he always has a cow about it. Mm -hmm. See? He's mad. <laughs> Chris, where you at, Chrissy boy? What was that, Drew? <laughs> I know. Chief's like, oh, Chris, I, I want you. Come over here. I yeah, know where Chris up I, I bet you he's over at, uh, Chris is, he's oh, probably on Jackie. one more man. He's up. Chris oh, is yeah. my blood. Jackie says we uh weed is better than alcohol. Is that yeah, your homie? Lawnmower yep. man. <laughs> Lawnmower man. I try to oh, smoke man. I try to smoke weed every day if I can. If not, then I, I don't smoke. Uh, Smoke weed every day. 420, baby. Yeah, there's a lot of people live right now. We got Tawny's live, too. Isn't Damn, she? How many on here? She's, is live? she's been live for a while. Yeah, she One, just got two, a blank three. screen. Matt was live today. Make sure you got Matt in. Uh, a jump on his bus. He did do a live today. He's probably he's planning on doing more. All right. As you heard, he's going to do a product review on his mowers and that. He's going to do a product review on his blow up dolls. I don't have any blow up dolls. That's Chris. That's now. only Chris. That's only Chris there. Well, well Drew <laughs> might have one somewhere. No. Oh, that's right. He threw it away years ago because he put a hole in it. <laughs> he didn't have a patch kit, he couldn't afford it. Yeah, right. That's why the garbage man meant. Hallelujah. I got me a woman. Yeah. yeah the, uh, the Matt's live stream number two is the one for the day. Yeah. It's, it's probably going to take a while wonder. before it gets over to YouTube. Hey, it's up. And you can see Whitey on there. Yeah. Kind of a little crazy, but it's there. Yeah. But it, it, it takes a few minutes for the update. Oh, it, it's all up and running right now. Yeah. I was watching it. When three six when three sixty five came up, that's where it started at. It was still uploading. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, it ain't come completely active yet. 
There's two, one of them, I got Matt's live stream one, and I, my original live stream two got, one of them got lost. No. Uh, live stream, two, I just named this in live stream two until I could find the other one. When I find it, I put it up too. Well, if you look in your um, past broadcast, I think it says that's where all, all that's at. Yeah, I only got one of them in there. Drew just comes and goes just like a yo yo. Yep. Bounce out on his head. Boom, boom. I was going to ask him if he's going to go live or not, but he just bounces off. Yeah, get yeah, get your butt back up here, Drew. Yeah, he's probably gone on to the Whirlies over there. He's probably over there or at Lawmore Man's. Oh, uh, watch. He's, well, we'll see what his excuse is. You're in Ohio, really? I thought she's in Michigan. Transporter room. Who got beaming in? Man, everybody's internet went out. That was weird. What'd you do? Nothing. Just sitting there talking, and the whole screen went gone. Are we, are we PD? Then StreamYard said, uh, reconnect. There's a problem. And I'm like, okay, reconnect. Internet. There I am. Internet. Well, the internet's internet. gone. Internet. Mm -hmm. Mine does that now and then, too. It did that three or three or four times like that. Hmm. About to block this person. Person's being a pain in the you know what. Oh. Are oh, they don't be that. <laughs> What happened? I don't know, but if everything's good enough, we can leave and he and he can't come back. <laughs> yeah, everybody's welcome here. I just joking with folks. Mm-hmm. Haven't well, turned do anybody down yet. House? Excuse me. Hey. What do you do? Put him in the doghouse. You see my arms right here. He he. he Bounce in, bounce out, unless he had internet problems too. Yeah. Should be. That one time when I was over at uh, Whirly Place, said I bounced out three times, and I said I bounced out four times. That's it. I never went back on because you know the screen went black, little circle thing going on, and that was it. Yeah. It could it be there. Loaded too. It hasn't happened since I'm ten feet above the router mm -hmm. yeah. in the kitchen here. Hell, I got a I got a Cat Five cable ran from the back yeah. room to the modem. Yeah, I was playing with my green screen, but I don't have a green screen. Uh, I was thinking about buying one off of Amazon, found a cheap one, but drone effects. But Claude said to go to the store, and you can buy the same fabric. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it'll be a lot cheaper. But mm -hmm. the thing is, the one through Amazon, I think it was $60 through Amazon, but it gives you the poles to hang it and adjust it the way you want it. If you buy the fabric, there's nothing here I have to do that with. Oh, here you go. Matt's got something to show you. <laughs> I think Matt's got so much stuff in that trailer, I don't know, that's why it's holding it down. <laughs> you need, what you need is something like uh-huh yeah exactly Man. exactly that's what the kids are in the comes. yeah yeah exactly you're right i don't have the green screen but i got the you got two of those i got two of those and the thing put the green screen up there you go i downloaded a couple of things i was playing around with earlier today so they're all in there and i just need a screen i played with them and me kind of fizzing in and fizz out. Yeah. Oh, I, can, man. I can show you. <clears throat> See? Ain't that a pretty ship? 
Which one is that one? I don't know. I can't read the numbers on it. Kind of look like the, X, uh, the, the Excalibur. <laughs> <laughs> look like I he's like stuck. In the, look like he's stuck in another dimension. <laughs> yeah, and I got this one here. No, that's not it. Oh, down here. There you go. How about that one? Yep, you know, bridge of the. Now the thing is, you just not. The colors don't match in the background. You. Just, <laughs> He's lost it. I'm the captain of this ship. How'd you do that? He just he just messed around with the blue uh uh the green screen or blue screen thing. I green couldn't screen. figure that out on mine yet. Maybe I didn't get that upgrade yet. Yeah, that's got the extra too. That's uh ten twenty two S. No, ECS, whatever ECS stands for. But gotcha. it's got the engines on top, and it kind of look like landing bays on the bottom, don't it? And they do, but that's more, more like Morton sails. Yeah, it looks like landing bays to me from, like, Battlestar. Yeah. But I can fizz in here, too. I was playing around with that earlier today. I thought that was pretty neat. So if I get a green screen behind me, then I could have those up and everything. That that'd be pretty neat. Well, there, there's other guys on here has been doing it. The one guy's got the complete bridge of the of the original Enterprise. I know. I know. Um, I used to watch um, one of these on, online uh, streaming things. They used to. Mm -hmm. Used to have, and, and now the site's gone. Yeah. Ever since, ever since all this stupid the CBS and lawsuits and all yeah, that yeah, stuff, yeah. people, people, the, the sites just disappeared. Final, you heard of Final Frontier, hadn't you? Yes. And they had they had some really good shows, really good ones on there for a long time, mm -hmm. and the other sun is just gone. Well, I think they're still there. They just they don't make any more videos. I thought I, uh, they had one. Uh, I think I was watching them last week. Hey, Rumpel, what's up? Yeah, the website is still on YouTube, but the website don't have nothing on it anymore. Yeah. Well, they probably made all the shows that they want to make, and that's it. Mm -hmm. No. <clears throat> I think I want to get off here and do a little live here. Now, Drew, when you sign on to your uh, stream yards there, when you get to the final, like you're going to go live, don't go live. If you look underneath where the banner's at, it says settings. Yeah. You hit settings and look down, it says green screen. Uh, you can do the same thing I do. You bring up a picture, and there's a little bar down there that you can play around. You can fizz out like I do. You can, also to give that try. you can also upload pictures and put them up there too. Mm -hmm. Like in my picture, I have up there already. Yeah, but you but you got to be using Chrome to do it. Yes. Yeah, Firefox. I do have yeah, that. Yeah. Yeah. Share, the sheriff trying to come back. I don't think I'm gonna go on and uh, create my live down here. All right. Yeah, bye. Thanks for coming. Get yep, the yep. like. Make sure you got everybody on the other side. Can't see you, Sheriff. You're blank. <laughs> yeah, that's weird. I don't know. Maybe that camera's not set up for... It says it's set up for, for a Wi-Fi camera, but... Maybe it's not. I don't know. I had one one time, just a regular web, uh, a regular web camera. It wouldn't work for crap. I'd send what, I would do, so. what I would do, uh, I wouldn't hook it up to use it through Wi-Fi because the lag in there. Yeah. I would just hook it up directly using the USB cable going to the computer 
and you know, it'll be live. It won't be no lag in there. Okay. Hey, doggy, gonna have babies, huh? Cool. Hmm. Anybody see the new series Picard today? I it, was up, it was up at nine nine a.m. Eastern time in Ohio here. I ain't, I ain't seen it yet. On January twenty third, twenty twenty, it was good, real good. You had a chance to watch it. I had to sign up for it, so. I went. Really. Yeah. I just money's too short to sign up for anything extra right now. Well, how t how tight is your problem? <laughs> tight. Well, let me ask you this. Maybe it's uh, it might be too personal. How, how many times are you eating during the day? One time a day. Ooh, that bad, then. Yeah. And I, I, I'm I'm to the point. Everything's out in the house. Uh, ain't nothing here. Oh. And it's been raining every freaking day. I ain't. I had to walk over in the damn rain. I understand that. And in in so-called family, when you call them. I ain't got time right now. And they sit nowhere and if I got a whole damn pantry full of shit. Man. Unfortunately, I, the girlfriend I lived with for 20 years, she still comes around. I get free food all the time from her. That's why I'm fed Hey, Eminem. <laughs> hey, Eminem, what's up? Ripple Silk Skin, how are you? Handy Stars, how you doing? Uh, uh, what kind of soups do you like? Any kind of soups? Uh, hell, I like, I like quite a few different soups. I like beef stew. I like uh, vegetable, tomato, yeah, chicken noodle, chicken noodle, different I stuff like, like that. Rice, rice and uh, um, chicken rice, different ones like that. I used to, I, when I had to, had the money to do it, I used to go over to Dollar General and buy some stuff till, till I found out it was called me, get me, called me to get sick. Really? Yeah. Uh, Wumpum got you a message down there, Matt. Yeah. Yeah. Because he ain't eating too good either. Yeah. It's been it's been rough on me, uh, ripple silk skin here lately. So you got to walk to the main house, which is how far away? There is no main house. Oh, I thought you said there was a main house or something. I had to go to the grocery store and get it. I'm sorry, I can't. I I misunderstood you. I live. I went, the main house is one that burnt down to the ground, uh -huh. and I'm living in in the trailer. That was on the my on the property. Okay. Well, I'm just curious. I don't know what 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 was going on. Hey, angels, what's up? So, Mister Druid boy, come on yet? He just went live all ago. Did he? No. Is he playing with his green screen? I don't know. I don't, I don't. I try not to watch. Well, put your mask on. Uh, well, I well, put your headset on. Don't work that good. Then you don't have to listen to him. <laughs> Can't smile on that one. <laughs> Dang. How that thing let every noise in. There you go. There you go, like this. What? What? Did what? you say something? Did you say something? True, I can't hear you. Speak up. I can't hear you, man. No. Damn, I'm leaving. <laughs> you know, this right here will filter that out more. Oh, can I hear you? Oh, yeah. I can't hear you. And, of course, Drew, was, uh, Drew had this here. And you say, what, are you flying or something? <laughs> oh, hell. You know, you know, my hearing is so sensitive too. 
Yeah. I could I could still hear some through those those headsets. I'm a three by three L L. Okay. What what's a three by three? I don't know. Okay. I'm just I'm just snacking on these right now. I am eating something. You make me feel bad because I got this stuff. <laughs> I'd like to have some of those. <laughs> I bet you would. We'll have to get the transporter technology to be real and we'll beam you over. Hmm. You probably never go back. <laughs> well, well, you know, if I can press through two or three different places at one time, I'll go to different places, go eat, and come home. <laughs> Yeah, at least I got a person that buys stuff for me. I just don't have the money for food. I'm so damn weighed down in bills, it's not funny. And it's funny. I had a 2000 truck, 12, uh, 2012 truck. I was two years away being paid off, and the brake systems went out, and they wanted $2,000 of fixing. I didn't have it, so I had to buy this, that darn white bomb that you seen earlier on your stream. And I had to refinance it. I was halfway through paying that, so I had to refinance it before I got another four years ago to get that paid off. Things just pop up that you never expect. Yeah. Yeah. That's the biggest bill I have. I did eat some chicken and dumplings earlier, uh, m and &M. Yeah, you said you you that you drink the broth first, and after that you said eat the first. Yep. What I've done, I opened a big can of chicken dumplings yesterday. I took half of it, uh -huh. and I cooked ate half of it yesterday, okay. and ate the rest of it today. There you go. It's getting where I have to. You just didn't have to do that. When my aunt was alive, she she usually cooks. She goes to the grocery store and she cooks, and and usually. We have a good good supper every day. Mm -hmm. But got when she got like she did, everything just went downhill. I just not able to do it all. And all this rain, I don't have a vehicle right now, so I lost mm -hmm. it. So I have no way of going anywhere. Yeah, I was eating cereal once a day there for a while. I just, I. Use all my milk and cereal up, and I had to get some more the other day, and now I can start over again. Yeah, but I, I, I'm not going to eat cereal more than twice a day because I'll be in the bathroom the rest of the day. <laughs> it's mm. crazy. That's something I ain't, even got, I ain't even got any cereal in the house. No. I didn't realize it was that bad. But, but you don't do any snow plowing, and you said you don't have any snow over there. No, it's hard, Eminem. It is. Um, I know one thing. I hope I don't have to sell my mowers. The way things has, things has way it been here lately. I'm gonna have to sell everything I own. Go out yeah. of business. So, do you charge by the season for the mowing season, or do you charge a per per cut? I charge. I I charge by the. By the cut, each one. I don't have a. I don't have a. I don't charge them by the season or nothing like that. Uh, well, they ain't signed no. They ain't none of them signed a contract yet. But I don't, I don't like particularly like contracts that much. But well, everything I got is under a contract and they're all seasonal. Yeah, I have during the winter time. I got a couple of them that's per push, but everybody signs a contract. So under seasonals, don't snow. I still get paid regardless. Hell, we don't even. I don't think there's any oatmeal in there, but I don't know. Yeah. Right now, I'm down just about nothing in the kitchen. What stores close to you right now? Mm, Terry store, but it's, it's pouring down rain outside. I have to walk in the rain in the dark. 
No, I wouldn't do that. My damn neighbors over here uh, told me, when I, oh, you got plenty of people come over. Sorry, I ain't taking you nowhere. <laughs> what a jack leg. You know, there's going to be a day in hell when that guy needs me. I'm going to just look at him and just walk off. Uh -huh. And then, you know, that's how people, that's the way people got these days. You ask them to help you, like, screw you. They're going to be, uh, and, and, and every one of my family like that. Mm -hmm. They want me to jump and run. Hell, they want me to drop everything I got to go do what they want me to do for them. But when I need help, hell with you. And uh, my brother does that. I'm going to come by and see you. Bloop, never did. But, you know, I still will get up to go, go help somebody else. I don't care who it is. I'm not like that. I'll do something. Uh, you know, even even my my brothers and sisters, no matter how they are to me, I will still get up and go help them. Mm -hmm. And and I'm uh, somebody told me I'm too gullible and and uh, just a sucker. No, oh, it's called that you're kind hearted, but everybody take uh, everybody it takes, takes advantage, advantage of it. Yep, yep. So do to me all the time. Somebody called me yesterday and asked. You got some peanut butter over there I could get from you? What the hell you want me to do? I'll be the store too? <laughs> and they expect me. I got one jar of peanut butter left. Wow. That, uh, and, 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 and I'm going to start eating on it. They expect me to give them my, my thing a last peanut butter? I don't think nope. so. They, yeah, exactly. I got Jeff. I got a thing of peanut butter in there, and they want me to just give it to them. I said, go to, you got money, go to the store. You got more than yeah. I got. Yeah, I got another peanut butter and jelly over there. I, I don't eat, even touch the stuff. Hell, mine, mine's a cheap brand. <laughs> oh, really? really? Yeah, cheaper and cheap. Better this stuff, well, this, well, this stuff was given to me. It's cheap crap, but it's, it's, it's decent. Uh -huh. Uh huh. My aunt the one bought it. You know, cheap. Yeah. Give you this. Give you the stove. A stove your ass up in a heartbeat. If I get where I get hungry enough, I eat them. Eat this. It's kindness for weakness. Food so does that mean if you're kind-hearted, you're weak? That's what some people say. Nah, don't do that to my dogs. I'll sit there and mm -hmm. <laughs> it's funny to watch, though. <laughs> Both my boys are sleeping under the table again. Now, kind of, kind, being kindness is not a weakness. Uh, it's just the ones that extort that kindness. My father, during summertime, he was he got a big jar of peanut butter. My father dips his finger in. He don't care. He, he dipped it, got a big hunk, gave it to Rusty. He's sitting down there. And mm, mm, mm. <laughs> he got another chunk and gave it to his, his other dog. Both dogs sitting down there. just. Mm. <laughs> it was fun to watch. Yeah, my well, phone was downstairs charging at the time. <laughs> that's something you don't give a dog just peanut butter. Yeah, he does. What he eats, the dog eats. Yeah. I tell you something else, don't give them chocolate. Nah, I know that. That's poison to their system. Well, chocolate. Yeah. Yeah, I do have Instagram, uh, m, m Let's look for FS Matt Zero. FS Matt used to be for flight simulator. I used to do a lot of flight simulator stuff. He took the he took the question on my mouth again. <laughs> Absolutely, so again, you're right.
You're absolutely you're right about that, Andrew. Dark chocolate's pretty is worse on dogs. Yeah. And then you know what? It's pretty bad on people to a point. I don't like chocolate as much like I used to. I can't stand it. I I I, eat, I don't eat dark dark chocolate. I might eat it with a little bit of a uh, caramel or something yeah. like that. Yeah. But other than that, I don't. I'm very picky what I eat. Yeah, that's FS Matt Zero all together. Well, that's why I was asking what kind of soups that you eat. Something like yeah. that. I, I like beef stew. I like... Uh, the basic uh, stuff, yeah. Just... Yeah, cool. dark, dark is pretty bad. Yeah, I mean, if you go to a grocery store and you look at candy, snacks, everything is 99% chocolate anymore. No. When I when I go to the store, usually when I go to the store, I get a, get a um, uh, half a uh, gallon of milk. Yeah. I get me some cereal. I get um, little Debbie cakes. Then I go to the uh, the uh, canned goods. I get a couple cans of chicken and dumplings. Uh, then beef stew. Might be, get a couple cans of chili. And then I go over to the uh, meat. I probably get some of those um, uh, those dinners. But they yeah. got they got so damn expensive on the dinners now. I just don't even buy them no more. Yeah. Eminem says he's gonna follow you. Okay. You got another bus rider. Who? Eminem. Oh, okay. Check out his lives too. He had live one and live two. Live one still in limbo land, somewhere. But live two is out because I was watching it earlier after uh, before it came on on here. Okay. But it's out there. You get to see me. I'm over the place. Get to see Whitey. You get to see my dirty place. farm, my dirty truck. You can even hear my Becca beeper in my truck. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> 105 dBs. I just got a notification. Yeah, you get those now and then, not too often. All the people I got on my bus, I might maybe have a dozen notifications. And I'm 841, 42, something like that right now. Yeah, on my on my Instagram, I, I just got another notification. Yeah, I'm not really used to this Instagram stuff. Yeah. Eight forty. Yeah, it's nine forty my time. No, that's how many subscribers I have. Eight forty. Oh, you're talking about <laughs> on. Um, yeah. I was eight forty one. Well, let's see what mine is right now. Well, Jose don't like me talking about my numbers. I don't talk my numbers when he's around. I got I got twenty seven. It fluctuates every day. I'm telling you. No matter what you do. Eminem wanted to be listed under. He don't have a picture up. It's all blank like. Yeah, right now I don't have one. Okay, this is, uh, yeah, he's got his private.
Yeah, I got I got a request from him. But it says his, but his is private. Well, you got him on your YouTube and Instagram. There you go. No, just Instagram. Oh. You got to follow on YouTube as well. Watch the videos. I think I, got, I think I got him on. on um, let me see if I got him on there too. Yeah. What what get what gets me? Um, yeah, I got him now. Confirm then. I so got him on. Interested. Yeah, I got him on um, YouTube. I got him confirmed. I got what him does there. What does it mean when dogs howl in their sleep? They're having a nightmare. Mine does that all the time. Pete will howl. He would be sound asleep on his back, and he'll roll over and sit on, and get on his front paws, put his head up, he'll howl for maybe a few seconds, put his head back, roll back, and put his legs up and go back to sleep. Yeah, yeah, I, I got you. That. I sent you a request back, in Eminem. Yeah. But I was told they had like little doggy nightmares and that, so that might be the problem. Now, Peanut, he sleeps like a rock all day long. Nope. No Philippines. <laughs> Check and see if I got them on there. Hell, I got over a thousand subscribers on uh, IG. Oh, you do? Oh heck yeah! I had that the first year I was on there. Yeah, I'm. I think I'm gonna change mine from bus to train. You're knocking on the door. No, I'm gonna be on a train. <laughs> yeah, or get or a spacecraft. Jim, you move in Philippines? No, I live in Ohio, USA. Bus is ready to go. I'm going to start shutting down notifications because my phone getting zapped all the time. There he is right there. Must be already on there. Oh, I you know I used to play Battlefield Three. I just don't. I don't. I just I played it for the PC, but I just don't have it now. Something my computer, but somebody hacked my one of my accounts, and I don't have any of that stuff anymore. I lost it all. Drew says he's he's alive. I he's thought alive. he's dead. Yeah, he said he's alive. Yep, it's me. Um, yep, it's me. It's me. It's me. It's Matt. 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 It's not Matt. Ernest T. <laughs> no Ernest T. No Ernest T. That guy was great. Yep, I'm about to respond to you right now, and you should be getting it. Yeah, Eminem, uh, yeah, that's me. I had a picture on there. Yeah, it just went just went through. Takes a few minutes on my phone. Yeah, uh, Jockey, I used to play Battlefield and Bad Company and all those games and on the, for the PC version, and and I lost lost my account. I could never get back in. Yeah, I'm I'm just looking at looking at the chat. I don't have that screen showing anybody and. 
I can't see now you right I'm now. Calling. Now I'm um, phoning them. Private account. Yeah. Dreaming. That's what I said. Dreaming, having done nightmares. Pete hasn't yelled, uh, yelled, uh, yelled holla during the night that much lately, but summertime he does about once a week. I mean, I could be dead asleep and all of a sudden I hear, oh, I'm like, what the heck's going on? They do. They do have um, how some. Yeah, I can, my, I I can miss make my dog now if he wasn't asleep. I can hear. You know, I could hear Jim howling. Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, come on over. I'll show you how I howl. <laughs> That's well, pretty you, bad. You might not like that. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, I'm also gonna send him. Dang it, I'm getting butterfingers. Well, quit putting butter in your fingers. No, you? no. What it is, I just my, my hand is. I've been holding this drink here. My hand is cold. Holy camolies! Damn, she's wearing lips. Let's see, on my Instagram at Jim's Landscape 01, I have 415 posts. I have 281 followers. And I got a notification that covers it up. I hate that. Yeah. And I have 1,035 following. I also sent you my address to uh, Eminem. I sent you my address to uh, that I helped. Well, send it to me too. You already got my address. I do. I I don't know. <laughs> I think you do. Oh God, we're thinking again. You're gonna hurt yourself doing that. I uh, I think you're trying to think again. But uh, no, I don't think I sent it. But nope, I, I got your phone number. You do have that. Yeah, that's all I got. Ain't too many people have that. Oh, I feel special. Just don't give it to Drew. I don't care who has it. I can tell who it is. And <laughs> Well, if you give it to Drew, remember to wear your galoshes or high hip boots. Oh, Lord. Because the stuff's going to be flying. You can, you know what? I just, I just sent it to you, too. So now you can count you part of, part of it. <laughs> yeah, I'm in Alabama. Andrew is where I'm at. There are wigglers. Man, there's quite a few people live. Alabama. Yep. 
Yeah, the phone, um, him and the phone's right here. Yes, I own. Wow, Andrew knows your state, Matt. Give yep. him a gold star. Who called me? Wasn't me. No, somebody Whoa. called me. But I see you alive. Somebody called me from a restricted number and it blocked it. E, you don't want that one. Don't want that one. Now, for some reason, now let's see, 954? Was that, um, was that you called me a restricted number? I have to, uh, I have to just temporarily disable that. Give me a minute. Because my phone automatically um, blocks all restricted calls. Oh, Tony's talking to the Drewy boy. Give me just a minute. I got to figure out how to disable, temporarily disable yeah. that. Um, block numbers, block unwanted callers. Temporary disable it. All right, now try calling. Ring, 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 ring. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Yeah, see, it don't give me the number. Now it's coming through. Hello? Hey, I'm hanging in there. Let me let me get off a live stream right quick. I'll be right back, Mr. Jim. He won Avatar. <laughs> See what happens on live lines? Get connected. Make sure you always check. Make sure you have everybody. On your bus or on your boat, your train, yeah, subscribers. Make sure you got all the people that you got. Need more? Well, try to get some more. Man, you're still here. Or did you fall off the cyberspace? We know where M and M's at. <laughs> The Rumpel says Andrew knows everything. Knows everything. Yeah. Okay. He says he don't know everything. So he told me the other few weeks ago. I don't know everything. Is that true, Andrew? Do you know everything or do not know everything? Hmm. I think he knows everything. I ain't trying to get him mad or anything. So, I think we're going to shut this down in the next 10 minutes. Helicopter's private jet. <laughs> there you go. Helicopters, boats, yachts, whatever you can think of. How about a Borg vessel? How about a starship? Hey, well, beam me aboard. Hey, Christopher, what's up? Well, beam me aboard, then we'll beam me back down. Or you might want to stay on the ship forever. Who knows? Hey, Maria, what's up? Yeah, Drews. Yeah, I seen you over there. Is, is he is he bombing out? <laughs> hey, nice to see you. Hi. Just watch that Drew boy over there. Always watch his face. You might see things. He's waiting for me. Well, I'm going to shut down in that, probably another eight minutes. The way I see and he's got a lot of people over there, so he can just talk to them for a little bit. Star Destroyer. <laughs> wow. That's a lot of people you can beam up, huh?
great. Rain in the snow. We don't need that. Nine inches. You could definitely keep that crap. I don't want it. <laughs> the most we had around here is like three, at least three inches. What we had that last time, the second to the last, we had that wet, crappy stuff. Whew. That killed my back. I came home, the hot water tank went out. It was like lukewarm water. You ever take a shower of cold water? Especially in the wintertime when you're all soaped up. That's the experience itself. I'll never make a video of that. You're probably, probably scared to death. <laughs> but it's a heck of experience with cold water. And especially when it gets more colder because, of course, the ground's cold and everything. And the water's probably under 50 degrees. We haven't had any bad snow this year. Uh, a few years ago, we had snow. Like about every day, we had snow there for from January to March, the, those three months. And I had snow over two foot tall at the end of everybody's driveway, and was starting to push snow inside the lawns and that because we was running out of room. People have these little small mini cars and that. You couldn't they couldn't see to get out of their their driveways but it took three weeks for all that snow to melt down so we didn't start mowing until oh probably the third week of april that year it's crazy yeah And yeah, cold showers suck. Oh, yeah. Takes a toll on you, all right? Takes a toll on your equipment, your body, everything. Bust your shovels up. If you, heck, I bought a brand new shovel one time. That sucker broke. I take it back to the store, and he says, What'd you do? I says, I put it in the snow, and it broke. Evidently, it had a micro fracture in it. Micro crack. So, yeah. Don't talk about that stuff. Start snowing around here. <laughs> but, yeah, nine inches of snow. Whew. I'd be out there for two days to do my route. I think one time I was up for. Oh, darn. Yeah, I was up. 26 hours one time 26 hours and i barely made a home and i came in here collapsed in bed <laughs> six hours then i got up look at the time yeah six hours <clears throat> i felt a lot better then i get a phone call from a customer where you at we gotta get over driveway we got six inches of snow out there i said man i was in i was in town i was plowing I got tired. I came home. I did the the contractor's work. I didn't do any of my stuff. I came home. I should have just probably stayed in the truck and that, but it was like minus five degrees or something like that. So I didn't want to take that chance. And the guy didn't have any patience for me. Well, you got to get here so we can get this done. I'm like, really? And I told him what happened, and he's he he uh, he didn't care. So, yeah, well, I everything I got's under seasonal contract. So, less snow, more money in my pocket. More snow, less money. Well, it's the same. It, it's the same amount of money. It's like being on Social Security, which I'm not on Social Security, but that's the way I call it. Like if you, if I have, I don't know, if I have twenty, thirty accounts and. I have so much of that coming in each month. I can't spend beyond that. You're limited. That's one bad thing about, about seasonal contracts. But without seasonal contracts, you don't have money coming in. So is it a no-win situation? Because if you had a per-push contract to push snow and it doesn't snow, you don't make the money, right? So if you have a seasonal contracts to have them sign it and they pay monthly like you know like a credit card would 
at least money's still coming in, right? Aaron Snowblowers. Heard bad things about Aaron Snowblowers. That word uh, pulley is on that, uh, you know, on the motor part and the belt and that. The belt slips off. I was going to buy Aaron's one time, but I looked at it on YouTube here. They have it all. Any kind of stuff you want to look at or a review is pretty much on YouTube here. But uh, I checked it out and that guy bought one. Uh, I was ready to go buy it because I seen everything was positive. And the next day I was going to go buy it. And this guy came up on YouTube. He made a video of it showing that the belt pops off. Actually showing the belt came off in the same model I was going to get. I'm like, whew, hold the phone there. So I didn't buy it. But I did buy a Greenworks 80 volt battery operated snowblowers. Nobody likes battery operated stuff, but I tell you what. That thing works great. I can do long, long sidewalks. I can blow 20 feet with no problem. Problem is, you only maybe 20, 30 minutes max. I have an inverter in my truck, chargers and all that, extra batteries. I can go all day, no problem. But yeah, I might, I might do a, a review on that stuff too. I got all kinds of stuff I can do reviews on. I mean, I bought a Troy built string trimmer. POS. I took and slammed it against the the wall of the shop. Two hundred dollars string trimmer destroyed because I got tired of its monkey. It would run, then when the gas runs out, you refill it, prime it back up. It wouldn't start anymore. It did that six times in me, and I took that, and I hammered it, and I says, you know what? It's mine. I can do whatever I want with it. So, But now it's got the same words on it as Craftsman. It's got Craftsman name on it, and I wouldn't, I wouldn't buy those. I got them out of Lowe's, but I called Lowe's up, and they says, well, you got to bring it back. And I says, well, I took and smashed it up so because I had to – four-year, five-year uh, a replacement on it, but I think they was discontinued that model. But the reason why they was discontinued that model is because the following year, they put Craftsman stickers on the same thing. They had the Craftsman red on it, but Craftsman on it is identical, the same as what my trimmer was. So I wouldn't get those. They're junk. However, I did buy a Cub Cadet trimmer at one time. Everyone tell me that carburetor was garbage, but tell you what, that one runs better than the other Cub Cadet I got that has that different carburetor that the Troy Build has on it. At least that one still runs, but not that good. So I told the mechanic the cheap carburetor versus the expensive carburetor, the cheap one ran a lot better. So that's my opinion, I guess. All right, Matt, he's talking away, so he can keep on talking. I'm going to go ahead and shut down. I want to thank everybody for coming in. Please hit the like button. Make sure you have everybody on the side over there in the chat. YouTube is giving, kicking people out now and then. Um, always, if you can, watch my videos. I got over 300 videos, I think, up right now. Got all kinds of stuff, plus live uh, streams like this here but this is the first product one that i did i figured it'd be a lot better to have a few people up here that has the same equipment as i and they'll give their opinion and i think it was dead on well, what do you think leave your comments down below hit the like button like i said check make sure you got everybody in here so uh, subscribe to me matt needs a, a lot of people check him out check his lives out Check everybody out. Okie dokie. You guys have a great night. We'll see you again. Take care. Thanks for coming in. Good night. Bye-bye.